What's up, everybody? So today I'm going to show you a house in St. Petersburg, Florida. And this is all one house, and it's just Christmas decorations everywhere of all kinds. Pretty neat, and I'm going to give you a tour of it. If you're new to the channel, welcome. And if you could please like and subscribe, I'd really appreciate it, and it helps out a lot. And let's get the tour started. So here's the view coming in, pretty impressive. In the front here, they have a bunch of nativities. There's like three of them. There's even a, uh, one that says, pay your tax here. Bethlehem. It's kind of cool how they have all those arcs. And there's that pond in the middle there. So there's lights just everywhere. There's even a pond in the middle of this yard, which is pretty cool. Even got a little bubble maker. I think it's supposed to look like snow. Here, there's a bunch of blow molds. Even have a train going around and a bunch of animatronics and uh, Christmas dolls in those cases over there. They have a uh, display case with a bunch of uh, animatronics. It's pretty neat. Got a bunch of plexiglass around it. Pretty cool uh, view looking up with all the lights. 
above. Another view looking up. Pretty neat. And they have this uh, waterfall and pond. It's pretty uh, interesting. I'm about to walk through it. And then behind this uh, window, there's more lights, some more animatronics. Actually have that one animatronic. So they got a light show going here. Not really sure what the theme is. They got some uh, exotic animals, stuffed animals. This right here is my favorite view from the house. You can see kind of everything. It's kind of in the middle and they got this pond in the middle. Yeah, you can just see the whole entire yard from this uh, angle here. Here's another look at this view. Sure what's going on here but uh looks like a bunch of foam overflowing and they even have this pretty impressive village with like mountains and all that pretty uh very impressive village it and if you could please like and subscribe that'd be great and until next time